Hey, how's it going, everybody? Stargazer 1331 back once again, bringing you Marvin X and Retro Suica versus my roster. Now, these two came from my Green Arrow Shadow Guys episode, which formed the famous well done, isn't it delightful moment that happened. And I'm not sure I'm not sure what to really think about these two. These two obviously are very strong, and no part in thanks to Marvin X, but I don't know, it's one of those ones, I, I guess I gotta just kinda see what'll happen, cause I think they're gonna win a fair amount, but I'm not sure how much Retro Suica will hold Marvin X back, or the other way around, Marvin X will just really carry this team, cause it could carry to such an extreme where, like, a lot of teams really won't have much of a chance, but, I don't know, we'll, we'll have to see. Really, Beavis and Nash? Sure, okay. Freaking Basher Nevis. But yeah, I think I think in thanks to Marvin X, this team should be pretty dominant. Because kind of the hope I have in regards to my, my intro there is that Retro Suico will actually kind of balance his team out a bit. Oh, oh my god, what a combo. That, that, that was sick. Oh, Beavis, get in there. Get in, get in, get in. Oh my god, he didn't even have to get in there. Wow. Pretty impressive. You got talent. Uncle, Uncle Sam could use you. <laughs> hmm, isn't it delightful? <laughs> yeah, no, fair enough. Yeah, this team might be more balanced than I gave it credit for. You know what? Good. Yeah, good. I'm actually, uh, that kind of potentially put some of my fears at rest, which I like. Hibiki and O. You're uh, probably gonna get fucked. The last time I saw freaking Gideon Graves, he just completely just curb stomped everybody. All right, Marvin, do your do your DDRX bullshit. That'll probably get you the win. Oh my god. Yeah, once these two get going, it's hard to stop them. 345 hits.
Why does that attack last like a fucking eternity? Oh wait, that's right. I think it's right because he's a boss. Yo, fuck this. Oh no! Oh, that was that was horrible, horrible placement of that move. fuck is going on right now? <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I figured that was super good giving a hyper. Oh my god, this is bullshit. Oh, and that's it! Wow! Damn, it just narrowly lost that 2 nothing. Oh my goodness gracious. Alright, well, well, well. Let's see what else they got. Yeah, I think the game might not be too kind to these two, then. Goku Black and Buttercup. That's a tough one. That is a tough one. Why did you aim up there? Claim this ship in the name of Mars. Oh, easy FD, fuck off. Oh, Marvin, you dumbass. Yeah, you freaking deserve to get caught in that part. <laughs> oh, round three. Boy, I actually haven't heard the full version of the song in a while. I, I tend to get a lot of round two fights on this stage, not round three fights. Ouch. <laughs> oh man, that is not good. Yeah, that's it. Wow. With this body. Yeah, I'm not too surprised they lost that one, even just barely. Yeah, Buttercup and Goku Black's a solid one. That's a team that's got a lot going for it. Yeah, I think this may be a very up and down episode, which, to be fair, I haven't had one of those in a little while, so that's kind of nice. I, I honestly thought Marvin X would just be super dominant, but yeah, I guess uh, it's either because Retro Suica keeps on using up all the power, or it's just they just don't have as good of a chemistry as it seemed. Popeye and Jay Fay, okay. Oh, my God. 
super finish. Oh, that is so oh no. See, it's when these two start doing this is when this team becomes incredibly mean. The thing that does help them though, is which it can be a bit annoying, I guess, in terms of a watching experience, is that their hit count goes so high so easily that the damage scaling starts to go way down. Oh shit. Oh, we're gonna finally get it. Also pause, by the way. Now it's all play fair. I love it every time I try to do Marvin, it just sounds way too much like Hermit. But, I mean, their, their voices are kind of similar, even though they're by completely different actors. Well, I think one by Jim Henson originally, then the other, of course, by Mel Blanc. What car are you doing? Oh, no. God dang it. God dang it, Godwind. Yeah, don't, I don't think y'all are winning this one. Yeah, I think this is going to be very much a back-and-forth episode. Cupcake. Ah, oh, man. Alright. See if it'll keep the trend going where they lose one match, they win the next. Alright, what do we got next? Hmm. Hmm. Alright, are you gonna finally get finally get a crusty pizza stage with this? Or a Terry Cruz for Jack Black? Nope. I've never seen this this intro, by the way. Oh, never mind. We saw this one earlier, just that you couldn't tell where he was coming from because the, the, scale, the stage didn't have um, uh, the super jump uh, properties. My wow. Well, they were doing it until they got basically zero to death. You do that move at like the worst spots, you freaking dumbass. Yeah, okay, you know what? Yeah, okay, yeah, you honestly deserve to lose that one. Oh, so never mind, that's back to back losses. 
That's one thing I've noticed immediately with Marvin. He's really, really good at placing his moves, except for that one. For some reason, his AI has a has just a has just the habit of just going way up there to use that move when it, it almost never hits anybody from that height. Green Ranger and Euphoria. God, I think they're gonna get another L. Jesus. Oh, I guess you just see the very edge of it up there. And another round three. Oh shit, it's, it's it's all it's all off the Marvin now. It's all off the Marvin. That's it. Wow. Man, another another round three where they ended up losing. Man, boy, these, these two are Again, I don't know if it's just lack of coordination or just the game just being hard on them. I, honestly, I'd have to say maybe a little more of the game being hard on them, but a little bit of um not being the most consistent or co oh fuck off game. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna do y'all a favor. Good, next. Will you fuck oh, oh my god game? Oh shit, they're actually gonna win this one. Oh my god, they, they, they actually won that. I mean, Uranus isn't as bad as Stone. Stone Orochi is, is just freaking terrible.
Ah, not the foot tapping. Come on. Yep, no. Still, still cannot freaking believe. Still cannot believe they've lost like the last like few of them. That that's that's wild. It's been a while since we've been a team with like this bad of a losing streak, and it's not even like, it's not even like we're doing like the double shacks where I expect a team like that to have like a really bad losing streak. Oh god, dang it. <laughs> Oh no, it's 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 the older Mobo as well. God dang it. And also welcome back to this stage of history. I mean, I mean, if they can keep mobile at bay, then yeah, they, they should they should have this in the bag. Oh god, no, no! Oh man, what a freaking tease, dude! What an actual tease! Man, there you go, Ram. Round three, they still got it. God, this is so close, dude. Oh, the yes, redemption. My God, disgraceful. Have you anything to say? Oh my God, man. Yeah, again, this is going to be one of those teams where, like, yeah, you, they may not win a lot, but when they do, man, it'll probably be a hell of a journey for them. Cane Blade and Nimwoo, not bad either. Well, that was, uh, well, that, well, that was quick.
Oh, yeah, it's the first time I've seen this. Hey, he actually did it at a normal, uh, normal elevation for once. Good job, Marvin. He, you did it at an even better elevation. Also, good job. This is a hit combo, what the fuck? Six hundred sixty-six. <laughs> wow. They that was almost a flawless. Well done. That is actually insane. Oh, goody, we're on. Oh, my God, man. What the heck? What the actual heck? Yer! And Fio, interesting. Good team. Get that earth creature and bring that to Wait a minute. Fio and Yer. If you had the Y, it... wait, wait, fear or fire? Fire? Oh shit! Nice. Oh god! Wow, these two are good. These two go very well together. Holy, holy, but Jesus! Hyper coin scratch finish. Oh my god. <laughs> Man, these two are freaking. These two are a machine, dude. These two are a very much a well oiled machine. And now the fall. Ouch. Oh shit, round three. I haven't heard the full, I haven't heard the full version of this song in a while. I tend to get a lot of two round fights on this stage. Oh! <laughs> wait, wait, wait for it. <laughs> right as the song ended. Oh man, that wow, that was wow, that, that was good. That, that was a solid fight. Yeah, for you and Yara, I might have to keep you two in mind in the future. Vegeta and Alex, that's not bad. That's pretty solid. Oh shit, he actually grabbed him out of that. Wow. He basically turned this into a 1v2 situation. That's that's actually nuts. Oh, right, right, he's turned to 68. Damn. Alright, round two. Oh, 
Ooh, damn. Wow, good counter. I do love that Alex can, can, can counter that, like, that weird guard state BS thing that the DDRX characters have. Because if you have a good, if you have a good counter system, that's, like, the best way to really deal with that. A little friend of mine, let's go. <laughs> Oh my god, they are both so close to dying. Man, this is it, man. Oh, nope, they got him. That's it, wow. Yeah, not bad. That was that was a very very solid um, performance, especially from the right side. Let me bring back the 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 uranium Pew thirty six explosive space modulator. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's see let's see what else we can get. Hopefully they're not gonna get completely blasted. Kafka and Sean. That's an interesting one. Get that Earth creature and bring back the uranium Pew thirty six. Really, Capshon or Shanka? Shanka? Oh my actual goodness! It's too wrong. Capka wins. You, you got it. You got to do the gangster rap. Wow, good stuff. I heard that Wilhelm. He freaking countered the beam and jumped into him and actually knocked him out and actually knocked him out of his attack. That was amazing. Oh shit. Oh shit. Marvin's getting smart. That's off the shot now. Oh, wow. Round three. All right, round three. Here we go. It's for all the marbles. So all right, come on. Come on, Kafka. If you would, all you got to do, all you got to do is just the gangster rap, and then this will, this will entirely all be worth it. Wow, what the fuck was that? Oh no. Oh, that's that's so mean. Oh wow, wow, never mind. Well done. There you go, man. I think I think I'm gonna call it a bit early because this is definitely gonna be one of these teams where I feel like we've kind of seen everything that they can do. It's really just more or less on just what the RNG will give them. But yeah, definitely a very very mixed team, capable of unleashing insane combos. But because of the way their damage, they, because of the way their moves work, though they don't do a lot of damage, but they have a lot of hits um, uh, associated with each combo, or with their uh, hypers rather. So I don't know. I don't know, they're definitely not a not a bad team, but I think just because of the way my roster is, they're the the game tends to pick more matches that don't work for them more than matches that do work for them. So, yeah, which honestly, I mean, I guess makes it interesting. It, it means that they're not like a complete like ironclad monster of a team or anything. So, I mean, I guess in some ways that's kind of nice. But yeah, I think that's gonna be about it for uh, me. 
you know, that actually be about it for me for a little while. Actually, I'm going to be taking probably a little bit of a mini break again, but until next time, guys, I will see you later.